Hello Aries, welcome to my channel. My name's Catherine from Soul Siren Tarot, here to do your December outlook, okay? Um, so um, just want to say before we start, thank you, thank you, thank you so much to all the current subscribers and all the new subscribers who've come on board. Growth of the channel is just amazing phenomenal and for that i thank you from the very bottom of my heart all right so thank you and um, darling aries if you're new all right it's a general reading it's not going to resonate with everybody if it does great i hope it helps you if it doesn't just kick it to the curb all right if you do or if you do know someone it would help please do share all right um I am going to do uh, weekly updates as well as we go through um, December, like I promised in mid-November, but I just thought I'll do a full December outlook and then we'll pick up the weeklies, all right. Um, I am going to do a part two to the reading as well because they're going really well, so if you do resonate with the reading and you want to hear more, you want the extended version, the link on how to do that is below in the description box, jump over to Vimeo, um, and if you want a private reading, then again, the link on how to do that is below, either through the website or uh, email me direct, all right. Um, but I, I'm pretty stacked okay which is great all right thank you to all of those who've already connected you're amazing all right Aries I've pre-blessed the deck so without further ado let's crack on with your reading for December Aries okay they're flying already shit shit right now shit and good as well right so Aries we're starting out with the tower right this this is spirit getting involved i'm getting it quite strongly i don't know what's going on with my fucking fringe i've been reading all day so it's crazy right um it, this is spirit getting involved because the tower is an abrupt change it's disruption right it's major disruption but but aries i'm getting a strong sense that because we can bring the tower down ourselves or spirit involves himself and brings a tower down i feel aries you've been in a situation i just want to say uh like in lockdown right in lockdown it could be you've been in your hermit energy you know your dark night of the soul uh it could be that you've been feeling um yeah, quite trapped in a situation unable to move yeah very frustrated aries whoever i'm connecting with in this message it could be that but 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 whatever's happening right spirit are coming in now right sorry it's just getting on my was right spirit are coming in now right and getting involved and, and i feel like early you don't see this coming but i want you to trust right i feel like this was in some of your other readings i want you to trust okay because whatever's about to happen even though it's going to feel quite brutal yeah because it comes from fucking nowhere yeah just like it's like boom the tower comes down boom that's the end of that right it's coming in actually to move you on but move you on to, 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 to a better place, a place where you, you're you going to rebalance yourself, Aries, you're going to refine yourself, you know, you, 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 forever Aries this is that I'm connecting with, I feel you're in a space that you almost can't see the way out, right, you cannot see the way out, and so spirit comes in to go bang, disrupt, yeah, open it up, there's your pathway, there's your pathway, right and it, and it can feel brutal yeah it can feel brutal aries can you see this is the five of swords i feel aries whoever this reading's for you've been battling quite the battle yeah and you've been battling for a long time and, and as this tower comes down it gives you the reason or the um the opportunity yeah i want to say the opportunity to just turn around and walk the fuck away right just say i'm not fighting anymore now i'm not fighting anymore i'm fucking done right aries that's what it is it's 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 i'm getting yeah it, it, it's 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 letting go right it's letting go of of, of of these energies it's almost like it's it's like an epiphany in a way um of, of you suddenly um it's like an enlightenment of, of, of you suddenly saying do you know what i was i was fighting for this particular thing for all this time and, and 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 it nearly brought me to my fucking knees well, it, well quite frankly the tower coming in it did bring you to your knees aries and, and now you're getting into that energy of I, I don't give a shit right i don't give a shit anymore actually because because what i'm realizing is i me aries i am more important than anything in the physical that's causing me to battle right as an energy source as a soul I am the most important thing 
it, because Aries, you know, we, we, we talk about this, in, I don't know if it's in your readings or the readings, but you come into this world alone and you leave this world alone, okay, because you're your own soul on your own soul's journey and what happens is we can get caught up in the 3D and the material and, and, and people who themselves haven't been through a spiritual awakening will, um, they'll, they'll, they'll put unnecessary stress, duress onto you for you to provide for them in the material, right? It's a very specific message, Aries. And, and, and what, you, what you're actually beginning to realise is it doesn't fucking matter, right? It don't fucking matter, right? Because, because I can't take it with me and yet I'm wasting my light, my life, fighting for it, Aries, you're about to be given an unforeseen. It's an unforeseen change of circumstances that is actually going to recorrect recorrect the path you've been on right you, because you've you, you Aries you've been going down a rabbit hole right stuck stuck it stuck in the dark stuck in a rabbit hole Con it's like it's like constantly on the defense constantly battling constantly looking over your shoulder yeah where's the next sword coming from yeah where's the next demand coming from and Aries you're going to be giving your way out so 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 I'm really connecting with an Aries right now we might be feeling quite battle worn five of swords here right but spirit's coming along to get you out right yeah you're stuck in a legal battle Aries that's what I feel legal battles legal circumstances right or you're staying stuck where you are because you're frightened of legal uh, matters, legal circumstances, right? You, it's like, well, I don't know what's going to happen and, and it feels quite intimidating to you, Aries. And that might be why spirit comes in to give you the clarity. And as I was thinking that, you know, the, the higher font clarified, you know, absolutely. It's, it's spirit saying, well, look, you know, you, you're kind of avoiding... Aries, you're kind of avoiding um, going on that path because of fear of the unknown or assumptions, assumptions, right? And, and, and you're about to be given the exit. You are. You're about to be given the way forward. You are moving, absolutely moving from the dark into the light. It's like whatever it is, Aries, that's keeping you up at night, it won't go away, right? Whatever it is that's keeping you up at night, okay, it's, 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 a bit, it's a bit like scary of the monsters under the bed, isn't it? You know, it's like I'm not looking under the bed because there'll be a big fuck-off monster there. And then when you look under the bed, there's nothing there and you're like, shit, you know? And, and, and you spent all of that, that energy worrying, being concerned about it, Aries, and you, you're being moved out of it. It's, it's like spirits coming in to say, look, you've had time enough, we're now helping you, yeah? We're going to guide you out, guide you out, show you the way. Page of Cups is here. Right. Now, I said it I said it won't go away because I saw it at the bottom. I shuffled and, and it's at the bottom. Right. Aries, this is communication from someone from your past, right? It could be this person comes in to, to, to support you as the tower lands, right? Or it could be that you reach out to someone from your past for that support. All right. But you, whichever it is, and it's the past, right? Because you see there's a fish in the cup here and it, it just represents a past energy, right? It could even be... Aries, that this is this is this is someone from the divine, right, from the other realm, um, coming in, right, to support and guide you. So 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 yeah. So if you're getting messages, Aries, right, you, or you're just getting senses of things, or you're having some some funky dreams, right, and I don't mean of a rude nature, all right. I mean of a like, you know, just when you're waking up thinking, what the actual fuck did that mean? Or that was a bit strange. I want you to start writing them down. Right. I want you to start writing them down because the, I feel these are messages from spirit, from the divine, from somebody on the other side. OK, who, who, who's trying to guide you and is, is going to guide you through this tower moment. Right. They, they're going to do because when the tower comes in, it, it is what it says. It's major disruption. It's major change. But but it's for the greater good. Right. But there's going to be times there's going to be times where as you're coming out of that tower energy, you're going to feel like you're sort of, you know, picking through the rubble. Yeah. Trying to climb over the rubble. It's like shit. Yeah. The rocks, the rubble, the hills, you know, ju ju just the, 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 you know, the rem remnants. Yeah. The remnants. And, and, and that can be. And I'll tell you now that can be tough because it because lots of people have opinions when the tower comes down right because what you've been dealing with are other people's interests aries and you're now moving into a place where you do you right i do me 
right? The, I'm sure in your mid-November reading, it was a little bit about, it was a similar, it's like you, you, you're going on, an, on, on another path and, and people are going to want to hold you back for their own politics, their own reasons, yeah? And, and, and that's what you're going to, as you're going through the rubble, it's almost like there's going to be a little bit more dark before you truly get into the light because it, it's like people are going to look at you as if to say, you know, uh, what the fuck did you bring the tower down for? Why the fuck did you do that? Yeah, because because what they're looking at is is, is not Aries, not um, is this better for you, right? Does this help you? Does this aid you on your spiritual journey? They're going to be looking at it, going, "But that was my fucking prize." Yeah, but 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 where does that leave me now? I'll tell you where it leaves you now, sunshine or fucking some girl, whatever you want to call it, right? I'll tell you where it fucking leaves you. It leaves you responsible for you and your energy and your own growth. And that's what should have been happening all the fucking time. Er is, that's what I'm getting quite powerfully. Yeah, wow. Say no fucking more, the world. Yeah, this is the completion of the major arcana. This is absolutely, it because it's mirroring the tower is such a strong reading, right? Because because what it does is is, is the world is the completion, right? So, so so it's coming through that full cycle, yeah, coming through that full cycle, yeah, to release, to release you. It's like I've 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 done all of that, release now, and this is the rewards coming in, Aries. It's the absolute fucking rewards coming in, yeah. And and all of these hands right all of these hands that have been pulling you down aries keeping you on the battlefield keeping you battle one yeah go and pick your own fucking swords up right go and pick your own swords up and do your own battles because i'm done I, I, i'm moving into an energy now this aries i'm connecting with right where i'm gonna relax i, I, I i'm gonna recover fucking cards are flying and um, i'm gonna recover And I'm going to heal I'm back. I'm going to heal, right? Because ultimately, sorry, what's going on here? I'll drag it all over the place, right? Ultimately, yeah, I want what's right for me. I'm here to do my life, you know. And, and this can be Aries, family, friends, a love relationship. It could be all of it, which makes it bloody hard, which might be why the tower's coming in, because it's like you can't see the wood for the fucking trees, right? But this is about you recognising that just because someone's related to you, right, in whatever capacity, they're not necessarily your real soul tribe, right, it's a mistake to have that perception, right, that that because they come from your loins, or because, you know, you've known them for 40 years, or whatever it is, right, or they were your nano's best friends, uncle, fucking whatever, so therefore I must be loyal, no, w when you come into this world as a soul, yes, you have your 3D blueprint to complete, and you'll complete that, but then ultimately it's for you, Aries, to find your own true soul tribe, right, because your soul pod is not necessarily that that's come from you, or from a past relative, or whatever, okay, you, you're moving now, Aries, into a place where you, 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 you're you connecting with like-minded people, you know, you're being freed up of some responsibilities, you're starting to get on a solid footing with the page of pentacles here, yeah, so things are starting to come in that you can now rely on, yeah, a firm foundation you can now rely on, and that's coming under this tower, it's absolute confirmation, Aries, that, you know, as this ending comes in, allow it, allow it, just just embrace it, you know, it, it, we, we, we can sit thinking, oh my God, a shitstorm's coming, right, hold on to, or we can just go with the flow of it. I'm no expert, all right, um, of, of infrastructure, okay, but, but, but I always remember I used to work in a very, very tall building, and when it was very, very windy, um, it'd move, it'd sway, and I thought, shit, it's coming down, and, and people said to me, no, that's the design, and it's the de design, so that it doesn't come down, and that's that's kind of what I want to get across to you, Aries, it's like the winds of change are coming in, uh, and at times it might feel t t too much, yeah, too much, out of control, out of control. Um, but what the important thing is, you know, it's like the trees, isn't it? Yeah, you, you know me. Um, you, you, you're swaying with it, yeah, you're going with it, you're just trusting, trusting the process, Aries. Absolutely stunning for you right here. Yeah, there you go. 
King of Swords. Um, you know, this is with, with the higher font here as well. I do feel right that, that there's going to be people getting involved in this situation, Aries. I don't know if you're going through a divorce. Um, I don't know if um, you know you're separating from a partnership. I don't know if uh, it's a job change or an employment situation. But it, but it's definitely got a big feeling of some sort of legal all right some sort of legal and and it's like that you've spent a lot of time being fearful of the king of swords a lot of time being fearful of the higher font and, and i feel Aries, it's very specific this message but i feel Aries, whoever this is for right you're going to be quietly reassured by the process so when it goes boom bang yeah and you're thinking shit it's all gone out of control you're going to be quite surprised, I feel, Aries, by the sense of relief you feel, right? And and the more other people get involved, because because these people, right, King of Swords, there's no emotion here, right? But that's, that doesn't mean to say they're cruel, because it's in the upright, right? If, if it was that way, I'd be thinking, shit, but it's not, it's this way. So, so, so they're able to see the facts, right? And I do feel, Aries, that, that this person is going to see what's really happened here the truth will out the truth will out Aries and, and I feel you've been put in an unfair unjust situation right and you've been trying to deal with that with all the weight on your own shoulders Aries it's a very specific message whoever I'm connecting with you've carried those burdens all yourself and they weren't yours to carry they weren't right it could be that you made poor judgment in the past and so you know you've took that burden on yourself it could be or is it could be that you know you um you 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 you, you took a wrong path you know um I, don't, I often talk about it i don't know if i but i often call it like you know walking through the trees and and different pathways etc but you always ending up you know you may take a slightly different pathway excuse me, I'm particularly throat from reading all the time, um, a, a, a different pathway from what the divine wanted, but ultimately, you know, it's slight deviation, you end up in the same place, yeah, whether it be the duck pond, whatever, right, but I do feel here, as you, you I, I think I said it in your last reading, but I can't remember, so don't hold me to it, um, but you shot off into the fucking brambles, there is, yeah, there you go, this is beautiful, right, because this is the nine of swords, but the reason it's beautiful is, right can you see it's again confirmation it the, the nine of swords in the upright is not being able to sleep at night it's stressed it's anxious it's panic it's upset it's feeling scared you know of the unknown um it's the, it's this it's this horrible you know churning churning energy and it came out like this right it came out like this and with this coming under the higher font next to the king of swords th that's where i feel this process is taking you aries it's going to reverse this energy right and, and, and as you come out of this energy you're just going to feel oh i just feel blessed yeah it it, it it spirit comes to the rescue it absolutely is yeah that they're coming in now to release you releasing the old releasing the shit dropping the burdens yeah and and you are going to be amazed at the energy release just what i feel there is it's a very particular message i always get i think there's aries and pisces yeah i always get very very specific energies like for those yeah look coming under this page of cups you, you felt very stuck yeah very trust stop very not able to move very restricted yeah it, it's like hiding yeah it's hiding aries yeah, because because you're frightened of being seen or or you're just trying to keep the status quo as well when you're in the hanged man. But that's like that's like no way of no way to sort of live your life, really. It's just restricted. You know, you've not got any personal growth or happiness. Not really. You, you know, you, this Aries may have been very good at putting a strong face onto the world. Yeah. Hiding, hiding, hiding the shit. But ultimately when you're on your own Aries no matter what you're doing for other people whoever those people are when you're on your own you have to face yourself and that's been really difficult yeah now this is stunning because the, 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 this is the energy I want to see right the two of swords is making decisions but the two of swords is it, it's a because can you see the moon as well yeah it's a brand new journey it's brand new opportunities open up but some of those are going to feel quite risky like it's a risky business Aries yeah and I don't mean 
repeating past mistakes, right? I don't mean that. The energy of this is just face it, yeah? Face it, learn from it, embrace the process, and just know ultimately you will feel great relief and release, all right? But this is making decisions as you're moving onto a brand new journey. Can you see? Take that fucking blindfold off. Yeah, stop hiding away, Aries, you see it? Stop hiding away, make the decision, and move forward, my gorgeous Aries, right? Absolutely beautiful for you. Aries, I'm just going to look. I'm just going to take some night cards, but look who's here. The devil. Yeah, you, you, you've been stuck, Aries, in this energy for far too long. Far too long right the tendrils have been wrapped around you and and the, the, the devil tendrils right it is darkness but it's often it's other people right whether you love these people or not i want you to reflect review and think do you know what have they been holding me back for their own needs that's what i'm feeling aries and i've have i been staying locked in fear because of that over over giving yeah you, it's definitely temperance here now look at this this is this is divinely guided. This is your angels coming in. This is alchemy, right? This is getting you back on your path. Out of the fucking brambles, Aries. On the right path where you start to feel that peace, happiness and joy again. You, you could be, you, you're leaving people behind who've kept you locked in. I, I'm just getting the word abuse, right? I'm getting the word abuse because temperance, the tower, the higher font, you know, these are cards of justice, the world, right? You don't, you don't get these together unless you've been in a very abusive situation. And abuse, you know, abuse is, it, it doesn't have to be, you know, people think, well, what are you talking about? You know, sexual, mental, physical, what we're talking about. Abuse can just be people not supporting you and using you for their own needs, right? In terms of, I need this and I need that and Aries, you're about to be free. You are about to be free. Yeah, it's you're getting out of jail. Yeah, that's how I feel. Maybe that you're literally getting out of jail, which is good karma, isn't it? Yeah, if you've learned your lesson. Yeah. <laughs> but it's ultimately it's ultimately being free again. Ah oh, wow. King of Pentacles. Beautiful. I'm finishing on this card for this particular side part of the reading excuse me an Aries is a very strong character this is male female for me king of pentacles it's absolutely getting back in your power getting back in control of your life yeah back at the steering wheel yeah remembering who you are remembering you're your own soul yeah with your own growth and your own opportunities yeah and stopping giving away unnecessarily to others because Aries, whoever this is for, you're not actually helping their spiritual growth by doing that. So I feel you're getting ready. I think the spirit's going to come in. I think you're going to be unveiled, pushed out the forest, right? It may feel a bit tricky at times. Trust your angels, trust your dreams, trust your messages. Yeah, embrace it and just know it's coming out for the greater good. Aries, you're moving. It, I, I just feel it's a spiritual awakening. I do. I feel you're about to go through your spiritual awakening. Right? So... Aries, I'm going to leave it there for part one, okay? Um, I am going to take this over onto Vimeo for part two, all right? So if it did resonate with you and you do want to hear more, my darling, I'll see you over there. Other than that, Aries, if you haven't already and you did enjoy the reading, please, please, please do subscribe. But other than that, my sweeties, I will see you uh, in a week's time. All right, thank you.